understanding the female orgasm, facts, myths, and the science behind it. Did you know that more than 90% of men experience orgasm during sex, but for women, less than 30%, especially from penetration alone? This isn't because women are hard to satisfy, but because our understanding has been flawed. This is what's called the orgasm gap. The first thing to understand, female orgasm isn't just about the body, but also about the mind. The brain, not the genitals, is the primary center of arousal. A sense of security, trust, and freedom from pressure are key. If the mind is filled with anxiety or discomfort, orgasm becomes difficult to achieve. Unlike men, who generally have a more direct orgasm pathway, women experience a more complex and rich process. It's not an on-off switch, it's like an orchestra. All factors, emotional, physical, and mental, must work in unison. Now let's talk anatomy. The clitoris is often misunderstood. Many think it's only the size of a pea on the outside, but that's just the tip. Internally, the clitoris extends and encircles the vagina in the vagina and urethra. With over 8,000 nerve endings, the clitoris is the primary center of female pleasure, twice as sensitive as the penis. Because of this structure, orgasm can be achieved through external or clitoral stimulation, internal through an area known as the G-spot, or a combination of both called a blended orgasm. It's important to understand almost all pathways to female orgasm involve clitoral tissue. Now it's time to debunk three big myths. All women can orgasm from penetration. Wrong. Only a small percentage can. Most require direct clitoral stimulation. The female orgasm is mysterious and complicated. No, it's just not discussed and taught enough. With communication, education, and self-exploration, orgasm is very possible. Orgasms are always dramatic like in the movies. In fact, orgasms can be very calm, deep, or turbulent. All forms are valid. There's no standard. So how do you close the orgasm gap? There are two keys, communication and self-exploration. Have the courage to talk with your partner about what feels comfortable and explore your own body through masturbation as a form of self-education. Biologically, female orgasm involves increased blood flow to the clitoris, vaginal walls, and vulva. When aroused, the brain releases hormones like dopamine, oxytocin, and endorphins, chemicals that also occur when you're in love, happy, and connected. During orgasm, the muscles of the pelvic floor and uterus contract rhythmically, producing waves of pleasure that can be felt throughout the body. Unlike men, women can experience multiple orgasms without a break. And beyond just pleasure, orgasms have many benefits. Relieves stress, helps you sleep better, lowers blood pressure, maintains heart health, boosts immunity, can even reduce menstrual pain. So orgasm isn't just about sex, it's also about health, independence, and quality of life. Every woman deserves to understand her body, and every couple deserves to learn together with respect and openness.